sparklers welcome back to my channel and happy mask monday to you my name is jessica sparkles and i'm going to be using this little mask right here this is the k beauty natural beauty rose face mask antioxidant healing hydrator redness soother uh, paraben free cool cruelty free for all skin types and it is by the brand supplya Su supplya that's how I'm going to say it. Uh, somebody sent me this mask, and I'm really not sure who, as per usual. But, yeah. So, you may see this giant thing that I am wearing. This is my blanket hoodie. And it is the most amazing thing in the entire world. The best $20 I ever spent at Walmart. So, it's big. It's lined in with Sherpa. It's warm. And I love it. It hangs about uh, to my knees. And it's just real big it's like a one size fits all it's huge and i love it i also bought my husband one a few years ago that's when i got these a couple years ago and they were 20 bucks 19.99 and i bought him a blue one and of course i had to have the pink one but um it is just soft and cuddly and amazing and if you ever find one get one um what else was i gonna say it's got the little kangaroo pocket here you know that you Put your hands in and I dropped the mask. Oh my goodness. Okay. So this is what we are going to use today. Uh, my scent of the day is Ariana Grande Cloud. And it just smells really, really good. So that is the scent. And I am having myself a hot cup of coffee because it's pretty chilly. And here's my mug that I am using. So I'm going to get a sip of this and we'll put our mask on. Mmm. So good. Coffee mustache going on. So yeah, it's about 30 degrees outside right now. Ooh, it smells like roses. It smells good. It's probably going to be cold because like I said, it's cold in this room. And it's been sitting in here. So I probably have a really cold mask. There we have it. And she's a juicy one. So I'm just going to set the little thing aside. Oh, she's dripping. We're dripping. We're dripping. That's okay. Nice and juicy. Nice and cold. Be very cold on my face as I ride the struggle bus to undo it. This one's not as bad as some of them have been. Some of them's been really hard to undo. All right. Let me flip it around there. Oh, it smells so good. I love it. Mmm, I love, I like, I don't mind the smell of roses. Ooh, it's very cold. Ooh, it's cold. It's very cold. Woo. But I like it. I'll actually like the things to be cold on my face, so that don't bother me. Now, I might be changing my tune when it's 20 degrees in here or something. <laughs> it has gotten so cold in this room that I could see my breath when I come in here. I do have a little heater. There we go. Just kind of pull that up. I do have a heater in here, but I don't have it on. It. Well, I did have it on enough to warm, warm it up just enough where it's bearable in here. But yeah, there has been mornings when I've come in here and I could see my breath. So <laughs> that wasn't this morning. That was outside. All right, so we have her on. I'm going to smooth some of that serum down here into my neck. And here we are. So I hope you guys are having a wonderful Monday so far. And I hope you had a great weekend. My weekend was all right. We didn't do anything. Um, hubby had to work Saturday. No, he was off Saturday. He was off this Saturday, but we didn't really do anything. We just sat around the house and hung out and... Um, we went and had McDonald's for dinner <laughs> because we had to go to the store. So we just stopped by McDonald's and grabbed some dinner uh, Saturday night. Um, but we just sat around the house, played games all last week. All last week. I cleaned the house and I got my Christmas tree up. Um, got my decorations done in the kitchen so my house is clean. And I've just been sitting back and enjoying the fruits of my labor. Uh, what else? That's really all I did last week. I went and got the Thanksgiving things that I needed 
it's Friday when I went to see my Auntie Rhonda and tomorrow I'm going to take her so she can get uh, her stuff uh, for Thanksgiving that she needs to get. So I'm going to be going to see her tomorrow. Um, and then uh, Wednesday, hubby will have to work till Wednesday and then Wednesday night he'll start the turkey so it'll be done and then we can just go to Thanksgiving on Thursday at my Aunt Rhonda's house. So woo so uh looking forward to eating some good food but i'm really just looking forward to christmas um as you can see i love christmas it's my favorite holiday uh followed by valentine's day and then saint patrick's day and then i like halloween mostly i like the decor of halloween more than the actual halloween so like i like um the ghost and the gothic stuff and things like that, uh, witchy stuff. Um, so I keep some of that stuff up year round. Um, but yes, Christmas is my absolute number one. Then Valentine's, I do like St. Patrick's Day. Um, and again, with St. Patrick's Day, that's the, the decor, the shamrocks and the rainbows and the four leaf clover, you know, all of that. So, but Christmas, I just love everything about it. The lights, the mood how uh, most people are cheery. Uh, some people are not, but most people are. Um, and I just, I, I just love Christmas. It's always been one of my favorite holidays. So I always get super excited around this time of year. Uh, last night I started making out my Christmas cards. So I did 12 of them and my hand said, girl, you better stop. So I was like, all right. <laughs> so um, yeah, so I started making out my Christmas cards. I got a bunch more to go, but I'm going to send out the first batch. Hopefully, the, uh, um, probably maybe Wednesday, because there's a couple of them that need to go to um, other countries. And I wanted to send them, even though they probably still won't get it by Christmas, but we'll see. Um, today, I don't really have much going on. I took uh, the turkey out to start thawing. Uh, so hopefully that'll be good for Wednesday night. Um, I got my chicken thawing tea for dinner tonight. I'm making like this cream cheese chicken stuff. It's like chicken breast and then you like uh, sprinkle it with seasoning, salt, pepper, you know, all that. And you cut up cream cheese and you like put it on top of your chicken breast. And then you um, spread uh, sprinkle shredded cheese on top of it and then you put it in the oven and bake it and I said ooh, that looks good but I am going to add a packet of ranch seasoning mix to it because yum first of all I love ranch seasoning mix for everything so I'm going to add that to it and I think it's going to be good. the first time I made it I actually saw a recipe I think it was on uh, Facebook I saw someone one of my friends or something shared it on Facebook so I thought hey I'm going to try that so we'll see how it goes I mean it can't be bad it's cream cheese and ranch and chicken I mean yum right so that's what we're going to have for dinner um and some mashed potatoes I think I might need to go to the store today maybe I don't know no, I don't need to go to the store. Hubby said he would go after work and he's got to pick him up some creamer for his coffee because I used it all this morning. I used it for him this morning. I did get up and make his coffee while he's getting ready for work. And he had to scrape ice off his car. So I'm sure that hot coffee was really good this morning. But um, yeah, so that's really all that's going on. Um, I'm going to work on some more Christmas cards today. I'm probably going to do a little bit of coloring. I'm kind of in the coloring mood. I'll play some video games and that that's my day. I do have some, I've been catching up on laundry, so I'm probably going to throw a load in here in a little bit. Um, that's really, that's really all there is uh, going on right now. So how are all of you? What do you got going on? Are y'all ready for uh, Thanksgiving? Are you ready for Christmas? I haven't even started Christmas shopping yet. And usually I've already got some presents by now. I got like three little ones, like the clone set for my husband. I got my brother, a couple of little things. So I need to get on the ball and really start doing the shopping. But, um, money's tight. So I'm like, when can I start shopping? Because I don't have any extra money. <laughs> so, uh, I'll figure it out. Uh, we'll get there. Uh, we always seem to somehow, but, um, yeah, uh, I don't know if I mentioned, but my husband's job gave them, gave us a turkey this year. So we didn't have to buy the turkey. So that's cool. Um, 
oh, he's going to cook it Wednesday and I'm going to smell it all day and it's going to smell so good and I'm going to want it. I don't know what I'm going to eat today for lunch. I haven't decided yet. I got stuff in there. I just don't know what I want. Um, I have been doing all of my grocery shopping at Aldi's lately because I can get stuff really, really cheap and the food is so good. Like, I've been sleeping on Aldi and now I'm awake for Aldi. So that's where I go because I'm getting all of my groceries a lot cheaper and I'm getting more for my money. So, and they have a lot of selections of stuff that, um, like you just don't see in the other stores. So I've been really excited and I like to go shopping there. It's not busy and I can take my time and look at everything without feeling like someone's standing there trying to push me out of the way. Hi, lucky boy. Hi. Hi, honey. My lucky. Oh, hi, baby. Do you want to say hi? Do you want to get up here and say hi? Oh, there's Mocha. No? Okay. <laughs> um, they're kind of running around this morning. They were outside and the cold air energizes my dogs. They get crazy. But anyway, back to Aldi. Uh, so I've just been getting all my groceries there and I really liked, um, been enjoying that experience. So I'll go, when I go to Chitty Shay on Fridays with my Aunt Rhonda, we just go to Aldi before I get ready to head home and we'll pick up some, I'll pick up my groceries and then I'll take Rondi home and then I'll come home. Hi, baby. Oh, you're so heavy. Come on. Oh, there's my big boy. So, big boy wanted to say hi. Here's a lucky boy. Say hi, lucky. Yeah. We saying hi to mama? You can't lick that. No, they're not good for doggos. I know. <laughs> so, uh, <laughs> I picked up a bottle, and I'm not a big drinker. I don't drink, but, um, I got a bottle of mold cherry wine because it, it sounded good. And I'm not much into wine, but that cherry wine from Aldi is so delicious. It's sweet and it's yum. If I'm going to have wine, that's what I'm going to drink. And I had a glass of it uh, Saturday night. Woo! Let me tell you what. That stuff was potent. Potent. I was like, woo-wee, one glass was all I needed and I had a little buzz going, so that's all I needed. It, but it was good, that cherry wine's really, really good. It says to have it warm, I had it cold. I don't know about warm alcohol. I don't like warm alcohol. I mean, it might be good, but I don't know. But uh, anyway, I wanted to try it. It was only like $5.99, so I didn't, hey, stop that. I didn't waste a lot of money, you know, if I didn't like it, so. But uh, it was pretty good. Pretty good. Pretty strong, but pretty good. Um, their salsa from Aldi is bomb. I'm going to get another. Uh, me and my husband drained the whole tub Saturday night. We had chips and salsa while we watched TV. And I had my little glass of wine. Um, but it was really, really good. The salsa is good. It just everything I get there is good. And even though it's not name brand, it's just as good, if not better, to me. So... Or everything I've got anyway. That's been my experience. So anyway, so that's what's been going on with me. Not a whole lot really. Just kind of hanging out and um, decorating for Christmas and getting in that holiday spirit. Um, Lucky, quit that. I'll let you out in a minute, okay? You gotta wait. Can you wait? Can you wait for Mama? Yeah, why don't you go lay down? Hmm? I know. It's cold out there. He's been out a lot this morning, and he just keeps going to the door and scratching at it. I don't really think he wants out there, like, to potty. He just wants to go bark at things. Um, him and Mocha exploded their big sock monkey this morning, so I had to go out in the freezing cold and pick up cotton. He always picks a toy to take outside, and he chose his big monkey. It was like a big, you know, it was probably about this long. Big sock monkey that I got Mocha last year, I think, for Christmas. It had a Christmas hat, so I think it was last year. And, uh, they exploded his bum this morning. I went out there and there's cotton all over the yard. I'm like, really? <laughs> so I had to go out there and pick that up and throw the monkey away. Lucky took the squeaker out of it and was, the squeaker was actually pretty big. So he was squeaking it, but I took it away and threw it away because I didn't want him to choke on it. So I'm going to have to buy them a new Christmas squeaky toy. They're ornery. Um... But yeah, so that's really it. That's really all that's going on. Um, 
I really can't think of anything else. I have a Christmas Advent coloring book coming Wednesday. I decided I would do that and color a page a day till Christmas, and that also helped me finish another coloring book. So that's the plan. I hope to color one, one a day. Um, yeah, I haven't really bought anything new or any like super crazy thing. Um, just been trying to save my money for Christmas and get people Christmas or think about what I'm going to get people for Christmas. That's another thing. I don't know what to get anybody. I have no idea. Um, some people that I want to send Christmas gifts to, the gifts might be late. Um, because I'm going to have to send them when I have the money to send them. So if I send you one and it's late, I do hope that you understand. And if I don't send you one and you think I should have, I already apologize because I just, I, I can't do it. Um, you know, we all know that shipping is high right now and I don't think it's going to go back down to be honest with you. But I'm going to try and get my cards all wrote out. I got plenty of cards. Um, if you wish to be on my card list my mailing list, uh, let me know. Um, my email is down in the description. You can email me your address and I'll put you on the Christmas card list. I don't mind doing that. I love to send cards and I like to send them just randomly throughout the year too. So if you want to be on my mailing list, go ahead and shoot me your address. Just kind of pushing that down. That's trying to come up here and there. But this feels really good on my face. And I really am enjoying the subtle rose smell. I do like the smell of roses. Roses are one of my favorite flowers. But my most favorite flower is an oriental lily. They're the big ones that are white and pink. And they're so beautiful. And my dream bouquet is oriental lilies with red roses. Ugh, I would die if I got a bouquet like that. I would just die. I would simply be deceased. Lucky. Child. It is okay, mister. It's not an emergency. I don't know if you can hear him scratching at the door or not, but he's up there going like that. But, um, so yeah, that's it. That's really all I've got for you today. It is time to take the mask off. So we're just going to peel it. Woo. Ah, oh, that's always so satisfying when you pull them off. And now we're just going to, there's a lot of serum. So I'm just going to rub that serum in. Oh, it feels good nice and moistured and it doesn't feel sticky it's a little tacky but mostly because it's still wet because there's a lot a lot of serum so i'm just going to rub that down get my nose mm. my forehead real good my eyebrows and just more down my neck mm. there we go i like that so pause or i'm gonna take just one second and hold this up and do a screenshot Okay, that'll be for, um, there's a lot of serum left in here too. I don't keep the serum, but there is a lot in there. I don't even know if you can see it. Yeah, look at all that. See it? There's a lot in there. If I had like a little vial, maybe I could like dump it in and use it again at night. And just kind of, But I don't ever keep it. I toss it. So, um, anyway, that's my Mask Monday. I hope you all have a great day. And I hope you take time to do something fun and relaxing for yourself. Oh, hi, Moki Moo. Hi. You want to come say hi now? Now it's Mocha turn. Mm -hmm. Oh. <laughs> hi, baby. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> hi. There's my Mocha. And Lucky's down here. Okay, good. Whoa. Whoa, children. <laughs> um... I think, oh, and there's Mason. We can't show him because he can't get in my lap. That's my big shepherd. But he's down here. They're all wanting to go out. So, oh, hi. Go in there. Go on. Go. Go, guys. Go. Be good. Hold on just a second. They're all wanting out. So, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this up. I hope you guys have a great Mask Monday. And if I don't see you before Thanksgiving, I hope you have, and you celebrate Thanksgiving, I hope you have a wonderful Thanksgiving. And I will see y'all in my next video. And remember, never miss a chance to sparkle. Mwah! Goodbye, sparklers.